the Q&A that we did two weeks ago went down so, so well. People have asked me to do things like um, come dress with me, come dye my hair. So I'm about to put on, I'm about to add to the colour of my hair this cherry sorbet and it's by L'Oreal um, and all I'm going to do is add it to these tones that I already have in my hair that are done by Frances Marshall and all she's asked me to do is chop it up so here goes I'm going to brush through with the tangle teaser first of all and this hair was washed um, two days ago so it's actually better to dye your hair with a bit of grease in so that's why I've left it because I'm just you can wash this in with shampoo but I'm actually going to do it like the shop does it I'm going to put it on dry hair that's had um that's had two days unwashed. So there's the colour, very pink. What I'm going to do, now I look like I'm about to perform a major operation but all I'm going to do is grab the ends and run it through so all it will do is freshen up the original pink that I had in it doesn't go bright pink because it's on it's on the top of a dark colour but this is the look that I prefer but if it was on blonde, it would be bright pink. Amelia, if you're watching this, you're probably having kittens, but it's not very professionally done, but it does the job. So. Amelia is the amazing stylist at Frances Marshall. Cut some colours my hair and she just gives me this as a pop. So I'll just rub it in. And then try and dry without getting the colour on my control. I am going to slightly take it through the fringe. I know Amelia will probably have a fit because there's no, no blonde on the fringe and the blonde is what it clings to. But it will change the colour of the dark, which is what I did a few weeks ago. So all I'm doing is giving it a good rub in. I hope you've all had a good Saturday. Because I was, it's been extremely exciting. We've been wedding dress shopping today. We actually designed the dress and we did it with a little bit of a difference. My fiance was there, which was nice. So, here goes. I'm gonna just tease it through the fringe. <laughs> it won't look the same colour as the end because the ends, like I said, have the blonde on. So, put it on. 
Okay, so there you go. I'll um, be back with you shortly to show you the outcome. So there we have it. I'm just basically chopping up the colour that Amelia put on my hair originally when it was first done. Um, it's a slightly different colour than what she put on um, because it's a colour that I could use at home but and as you can see there's different tones but if you think about it naturally everybody even if your hair's a natural colour and it's your own colour people don't realise that your hair's made up of different colour tones so I'm pretty happy with that considering it wasn't done at the hairdressers um, it'll do until it gets cut again and also um, they brought out some pinky conditions to kind of try and hold the colour a little bit so what I'll do is I'll pick up a lighter colour and hopefully get a few different tones in there which will be very nice okay I'll catch you later bye bye